So here's a great example of an entity that I've got to admit I'm seeing more and more often, and I'm not sure if it's more common or for the most part, we're just recognizing it more often. Notice on these MR images, there's this rind of T2 hypointense soft tissue surrounding both kidneys. There appear to be several discrete lymph nodes within this rind of soft tissue, and on the correlative CT image, you can again see this intermediate soft tissue density encasing both kidneys without apparent hydronephrosis. Now, I've got to admit, when I read this case initially, I didn't really even offer much of a differential diagnosis. I suggested that this was most likely perirenal lymphoma. There appeared to be some soft tissue extending medially into the retroperitoneum as well. But this ultimately turned out to be a completely different entity. Look at the bone scan image. There's diffuse uptake in the distal tibial, or the proximal tibial diaphysis, the metaphysis, the epiphysis, and the distal aspect of both femurs. This is a beautiful example of Erdheim-Chester. And you've really got to be cognizant that there is a differential diagnosis when you're dealing with perirenal soft tissue thickening. Lymphoma is by far the most common, but there are other entities as well. And Erdheim-Chester is one of those entities that you should be thinking about.